people will pay it. And then there's the merchandise. And I can personally Donald, I... Donald. This park was not built to cater only for the super rich. Everyone in the world has the right to enjoy these animals. Sure, they will. I mean, what, we'll have a, a coupon day or something? <laughs> yes. <laughs> Gee, the lack of humility before nature that's being displayed here um, staggers me. Well, thank you, Dr. Malcolm, but I think things are a little bit different than you and I had feared. Yeah, I know. They're a lot worse. Now, wait a second. Now, we haven't even seen the part no, where no, no, Donald, 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 let him talk. There's no reason. No, no, I want to hear a review part. I really do. Uh, yeah, don't you see the danger, uh, John, inherent uh, in what you're doing here? Genetic power is the most awesome force the planet's ever seen, but you wield it like a, a kid that's found his dad's gun. It's hardly appropriate to start hurling <laughs> generalizations. Uh, uh, if I may. Um, I'll tell you the problem with the scientific power that you're that you're using here. Uh, it didn't require any discipline to attain it. You know, you read what others had done, and you and you took the next step. You didn't earn the knowledge for yourselves, so you don't take any responsibility for it. You stood on the shoulders of geniuses uh, to accomplish something as fast as you could, and before you even knew what you had, you you patented it and packaged it and slapped it on a plastic lunchbox, and now you're selling it. You want to sell it? Well. I, I don't think you're giving us our due credit. Our scientists have done things which nobody's ever done before. Yeah, yeah, but your scientists were so preoccupied with whether or not they could, they didn't stop to think if they should. Condors. Condors are on the verge of extinction. And if oh, I was no. to could not know, if I was to create a flock of condors on this island, you wouldn't have anything to say. No, hold on. This isn't this isn't some species that was obliterated by deforestation or or the building of a dam. Dinosaurs. Uh, uh, had their shot, and nature selected them for extinction. I simply don't understand this Luddite attitude, especially from a scientist. I mean, how can we stand in the light of discovery and, and not act? Oh, what's so great about discovery? It's a violent, penetrative act that scars what it explores, what you call discovery. I call the rape of the natural world. <laughs> 